Hi Taurus, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of August 15th, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. Uh, if you're seeking a personal reading, it's JackieTomlin.com and be warned of the scammers in my comments section. Okay guys, this is about a new beginning and relaxing and taking care of you. Okay, now I want to say if you are separated from someone or something, it is going to be temporary. Uh, trip out of state may be in the works. There's new money coming in. It's a week of total victory and someone you know close to you is going to offer some assistance. A good business deal. And you can expect uh, the clarity or confirmation of something that you have been wondering about. So, a lot going on for my Taurus this week. We'll see what we have here. Starting off with the Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups comes in. Um, this is victory and success um for some of you a new pet may be at play here okay uh but it's saying to open your heart open your heart to give love open your heart to receive love and yeah a scorpio may come into play king of pentacles comes in with total and complete financial stability for some of you a gemini may resonate with you and with that, we have the Six of Pentacles. There is something coming in to restore your financial balance. Um, believe it or not, you may not feel it right now, okay? But what I'm seeing here is something is coming into play that is not only going to restore your financial balance, it's going to enable you to help someone else out financially down the road, okay? Um, for some of you, I'm going to say you may be signing some kind of document. That pops out, so I want to throw that out there as well. We also have strength, major arcana of strength. Strength is on your side no matter what you do. Now, let me say this. I really want to stress, it's not strength because I see you as needing strength. This is strength because it's going to be just a crazy, busy week. And with that, you're going to need the strength to get through. And we have the king of wands king of wands says you're taking authority you're tired of being walked over you are tired of someone taking advantage or using you you're putting your foot down you're being true to yourself that is the center of your reading also an aries may or may not resonate you are surrounded by a lot of people this week we have the knight of swords fast pace quick moving energy something is rushing in what is rushing into my taurus it is the death card energy Death card energy says you are in a strong, powerful new beginning, okay? This is um, endings and closures, rebirths and new beginnings. It's one door closes, one door opens. It all happens at one time. And because it happens at one time, it's going to create this feeling of um, a lot of emotions being provoked, okay? So it may be a very emotional week for you. We also have the tower card moment. Nothing like the tower going with the devil, uh, with um, the death card energy. The tower is nothing to be feared, but this is sudden and quick changes. And honestly, Taurus, this is your temper. This is something that has made you mad and then you quickly move away from it. And we're going to clarify that and see what that's all about. We have here the hangman. All this crazy energy around it, and you guys are feeling stuck. You feel like you're not moving forward, you're not moving backwards, and perhaps there's just no movement around you. That is not the case whatsoever. It's asking you to be still. Because when you're still, the clarity that you need and the answers that you seek actually come to you. So let's move further with these messages and see why these cards are here. What else you need to know? This is Taurus. This is for your week of August 15th. 2022. Okay. Taurus. King of Cups. I do, it hasn't shown me this yet, but I do feel that y'all are under a strong new beginning in regards to communication. Uh, perhaps as someone you've been waiting to hear from or someone you've been out of touch with for a very long time will actually reach out to you. Okay, on the King of Cups, we have the Two of Pentacles. If you guys have been juggling financially, you know, um, like borrowing from Peter to pay Paul, or just out of your comfort zone, it does let me know that those days are almost over. We have the Devil card energy, okay? 
Um, I don't see anything negative to go with this devil. Let me clarify that once. No, it's going to be in your love life. You're coming off pretty intense on love. There is an unexpected offer of love here for you. Now, if you're in a couple situation, that could be the love of family or friends. But for my singles, that's going to be significant this week. Okay. And then we have that Six of Pentacles coming in with the High Priestess. This says... You are grounded. You are centered. You are very intuitive, but you're scared to tap in and trust that intuition. It's asking you to trust where you're being led. On the strength card comes the Queen of Wands, Leo energy. Happy, go lucky, grounded, centered, taking charge. You're taking authority. You're putting your foot down. You're saying, I've done A, B, and C. So now it's time to stop and we're going to do X, Y, and Z. Okay. On the King of Wands, we have the Wheel of Fortune. The wheel is finally turning into your favor. This is good luck and abundance. This is also indicating a partnership. This could be in love as well as in business. And we have the Knight of Swords. What else is rushing in? Reconnecting with someone from your past, someone you are thrilled to reconnect with. We have that death card energy. Part of that new beginning is a new relationship. For those that are in a committed relationship, you're about to level up. This is engagements, living together, vows, commitments, things of that nature. And for those that are totally single, you could be in a relationship in a matter of days. Okay? And on that tower card energy, what has provoked the tower? Oh, I must say it's jealousy. You have leveled up. You are overcoming your goals. You have uh, created a new path. You have created a better path. And you created the right path. And yeah, you may have to get mad and voice your opinion to someone who really may not want to hear that. Okay? And then on the hangman energy, there is the lovers. You are going to be strong in love this week. And your bonus card in the center of the reading, we have the Two of Swords. Two of Swords tells me you've got decisions that you've been putting off for too long. This is the week to take care of them. So, Taurus, thank you for joining me. You guys have a fantastic week. Don't forget JackieTomlin.com if you're seeking a personal reading, and I'll see you soon. Bye.